On a hot Saturday afternoon, over 100 Calgary Basset Hound owners and their dogs gathered for a day at the races. The event, known as the Basset Waddle, is in its sixth year, and it offers more than just an opportunity to see a group of hounds frolic and play. This is great, like it's the one time we get all the Basset community together which is nice for everyone to chat to each other and hear from all the dogs. <laughs> it's, the, it's the time you, we, can, we can chat to our supporters because we have a lot of people who work with us throughout the year. We have people that help transport, people who foster for us, people who, do, people who adopt our dogs. It's nice getting to catch up with all those guys, seeing how the dogs we've rescued are doing, have a chat to some of the other people who send, like you know, they help us out with our vet bills when we're struggling throughout the year. It's a nice way to say hi, thanks and have come have fun. As you can probably tell they're not very well set up to be agility dogs. There are some very good agility bassets, I have to say. I do know a couple, but for the most part, they do tend to fail miserably when it comes to this. So this is really a bit of fun to give people a chance to let the dogs do something, but also give prizes to those who really excel and give prizes for those who really, really suck. It's too much for her. I'm going to kill her here. But the event also serves as a very important fundraising opportunity for a local Basset rescue organization. So it's our annual fundraiser for the Calgary Basset Hound Rescue Society. And we do this event to bring people together to kind of form our community. But it's also for rescue awareness of all breeds, not just Basset Hounds, and an opportunity for a fun thing to do in the fall. Even though temperatures exceeded 30 degrees, over 200 people cheered on the hounds as they took to the track. For the Calgary Journal, I'm Matthew Hayhurst.